हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम दीपशिखा वेलकम यू इन दीपशिखा कारोशिल टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू डू रशियन आर्ट और स्कल्पचर पेंटिंग ऑन दिस ब्यूटीफुल ज्वेलरी बॉक्स दिस इज अ परफेक्ट गिफ्ट आइडिया फॉर योर लव वन स्कल्पचर पेंटिंग्स आर वेरी फेमस फॉर इट्स टेक्सचर एंड इट गिव्स अ वेरी नेचुरल लुक टू द वर्क For making this project we need a wooden or MDF box like this palette knife number 1 and 3 sculpture paste green red and white stencil for texture chalk paints and a white gesso for the base coat i applied varnish all over the box for longer life of the box then I am going to apply gesso using sponge. Cover the box completely with a layer of gesso. Keep it aside and let it dry for some time. Till then, I will prepare my flowers. I am taking some amount of red sculpture paste also adding some red acrylic color as my sculpture paste is little dry Mix the sculpture paste very well. Spread the sculpture paste evenly on the tray. Then drag them and collect them in this way. And now petal is ready this way make all the petals and keep them on the tray we'll assemble it later Clean your palette knife time to time with a dried napkin. Make all the petals this way. For the middle part of the flower, make small ball 
with the same sculpture paste like this. Then place the petals one by one by overlapping them. Adjust the shape and size of the petals accordingly. Don't hesitate to use your hands. Repeat the same process for all the petals. Be gentle and apply a very less pressure because sculpture paste are very lightweight. For the lighter shade, Mix white sculpture paste with the red one. For making small bud, roll the paste and then add two small petals like this. Our flower and bud are ready. Now I will do the texture work on the top of the box using stencil and blue sculpture paste. I made this blue sculpture paste by adding blue color in white sculpture paste. Mix and spread. That's it.
Now let's make the green green leaves. Now spread the paste evenly on the board and scrape it from one direction. Put it on the tray and then do the same from the other direction. Now join the two sides together for a leaf shape. Also give impressions on the top. Place the leaves on the box. Now I will place the flower on the box. Be very gentle while shifting the flower. Before shifting the flower, I will apply some Febicol because my flower is little dry now. Press the petals toward the base using palette knife. Add the bud and also add other leaves in the same way. Place them accordingly. Our flower and leaves are ready. But the side of the box is little boring. So I am going to add a little texture on it. So I will use the same stencil and the blue color for the texture work. Now 
this should be done before flower and leaves because it is quite difficult now Tantara, our box is ready now. You can use this box for multi purpose. So friends, if you like this video, don't forget to like, share and subscribe. And you can also check my Insta and FB page Dipshikha's Karushil for more art and craft ideas. Thanks for watching.